Hello guys, we're back with another brand new invention. No, uh, this is a recap of a video uh, I've done previously about uh, the Ultian. So obviously we have the old Ultian and we have the WXM. Uh, now, obviously I've been running the training course for a while now and a lot of people are actually already locksmiths and they're telling me how, how, how much they're struggling with the GJ pick. But obviously once they've done the course and I show them where they're going wrong, where they're going right, uh, you know, detect to it better. So it's it, it's just a little technique. Uh, but this is going to be a video of why I prefer the GJ pick over the N Super. Okay, obviously I have them both because options, options, options. Uh, and obviously for ease on the video, I've got two different ones. So I've got a GJ set up with the WXM wire and a GJ set up with the old wire. Uh, now, first things first, you're going to say, you know, why do I prefer this? So if I can just get out a WXM pick here. Uh, let's see if this one is okay. Yes, so this one is okay. But what you will notice, if I can just focus and spin this round a little touch, is the bend in the wire. Let me see if you can focus on that. There you go. Ever so slight curve in the wire, okay? Now, that's not a problem once you're proficient and all that stuff. Uh, but in the last courses that I have run, so... There you go, you can see that wire is absolutely bent right back, so that's that fucked, all right? And then, as you can see, that one's in surgery, because I'm actually trying to replace the blade, but you need a degree in engineering to do that. It's actually, I, I did actually try bending the wire straight, all right, uh, but because of the way they are, they're just gonna snap. In fact, I've got a brand new wire here, so this is a perfect way to show you. So that's what the curve of the wire is. Yes, very, very nice. But you can see how delicate that is. Any sort of force on that, you're going to bend it and the tool's just never going to work again. Simple as that, all right? So I'm going to show you my method on picking up an Ultians. So as you can see, I've got these set up there. So these have actually, they're all off live jobs. These aren't brand new jobs, but I like to mark them up. So these are locks that I've picked up and, and obviously I've been allowed to keep. So there you go. So you've got the GJ, old Ultian, GJ, old Ultian, GJ, WXM. Yes, smash the granny out of that and a GJ WXM. Now you're gonna see different techniques that I use with each of them, and all it's about is learning about the lock, all right? Too many people get focused on the lines and stuff like that and the corresponding, especially when it comes to the GJ. This is more about feel, but I can promise you, you'll whiz through them. All right, guys? So this is the GJ for the old Ultian. Now my million dollar bit of advice is basically, if you turn the pick round like so, you just want to take a file or a bit of sandpaper just underneath there because basically it'll just sit better on this wording. Now people get too fixated over the lines, okay? So they're like, boom, right, that has to be that. But you don't. So this is all about feel. And you're gonna see you're gonna see in this lock in particular different characteristics. So this one, literally, I'm just tickling my way through and just I felt a very tiny, tiny little click then. As you can see, I'm 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 going in between the lines, fettling back and forth. Now this pin was difficult to get to. Okay, which is always a good sign. There, we've got another click then. All right, a bit of rotation. As you can see, I'm not particularly going any order. It's just more about feel. So this one has got loads of what I call uh, high pins. So I'm not having to click anything down. Uh, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Just fettle our way through. And another click. There we go. So just don't worry. Just go back, back and forth through it a few times. All right. Let's have a look. No, not you. You're not playing ball. I'm not playing ball. There we go. Got another sl slight click. So you don't need to. I think I've probably overset a pin there just because I'm waffling on. Yeah, probably have. So, all we do, won't be shy, guys. Just start again. All right. Tension on. And we're just going to feel our way through. Tick, 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 tick. jump then it's all about the feelings yeah, nice click then let's see if we can get this bitch to jump this is always a good sign when it's difficult to get past not you not you there we go got it so that is literally, the, there was only like one significant click on like the N Super. So this is literally about tickling back and forward. Okay, so don't get too obsessed with the lines and stuff like that. So I'm gonna flick over now to 
WXM, sorry, all right, so again, I have modified my tool a little bit, but this is just my personal preference, so I'll just get this one out, so obviously it's the same one, just different wires, now all I've done with this is I've taken a file to the underside of the wire and fettled it down and narrowed it down a bit just so it curves over the pins nicely because obviously it's sat on the right so hopefully you'll get to see a bit of tickling so no you're fine you're fine you're fine mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. in fact there's someone nice nice all right, so don't be shy looking for them binders. Let's have a look at you. Oh yeah, that was a nice feeling. All right, sorry about that, guys. Wife was ringing, you know what I mean? She must be all bed. I'm not like I can ignore her, is it? Right, <laughs> let's start this again. So, in we go, tension. Again, don't get too focused on the lines, just fettle your way through. Okay, tickle, tickle. Tickle, no there, nothing there, it all feels like that. When it all feels slack, you know that one of them's gonna be a binder, Sim you know, it's as simple as that. And I think, yeah, number one. And I'll just tickle number two, nice. Three is solid at the top, so we're gonna leave that alone. Four. Have I overset you now, you little mucky pup? Three, two, uh, no, uh, I might have overset one now. Women putting me off my game. No, we've got it. Right, so, again, it's not about just focusing on one, two, three, burr, 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 right? That was a piece of piss, and obviously I've done that in a live job. Now, hopefully, I'm gonna do one more now, and you're gonna get to see this, so it's all unedited video, so this is a WXM thumb turn and hopefully you're going to get to see why this is better obviously that's one one piece of stainless sprung steel or whatever you want to call it okay and obviously i've shown you the wxm wire uh so hopefully i'm going to get this to drop into its uh full set and that is when you do need the counter rotation and to click it into place and i can pretty much guarantee that's where people have bent the wires all right so let's just have a look see if i can do this can't guarantee it, can't guarantee anything, but we're gonna have a do. So, and, 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 no you, no you. No, not you, not you, not you. Is it you? Hopefully I can get it to fucking go. Without looking like too much of a plum. Mm. No, no. 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 Come on. Stop being a monkey. No. No. I'll start that one again. Session. Oh, that's a stiff bugger to get past. Oh, well, trust me, me being me, being awesome, I've actually got the fucking lock. Uh, but what this lock will do, what did happen actually on the job, is it jumped into a deep false set. Uh, and obviously, you've got to apply, uh, you've got to release tension slightly, but still enough to keep the core where it is, and then press down, press down, press down, press down. Press down and click it into place. Now, I can pretty much guarantee that's what happened with the N Super, and that's why they bent it. Or, basically, with the N Super, obviously, you go along feeling for the clip, bum, 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 bum. And then if you get nowhere, basically, you know that you're gonna have to, one of them solid pins that you think solid is gonna have to get clipped. And someone got a bit overzealous and tested, 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 tested each one, and probably pressed down on a solid pin. Uh, and it's almost impossible to do with the GGA wire just for the fact that it is one solid piece of wire and the upstand on it is very short. Anyway guys, that was a long, long waffling video. I hope you took some from it.
stay calm, stay well, and I'll see y'all motherfuckers soon.